So here we have log of square root of x that is cube root of 10y and this is z to the power of 10 and the base is 4 Okay. For this, we need to know some rules. Let's review those rules. If I have log of x times y or if I have log of x over y now the second one is the one that we are applying here log of x over y um, do you want to try yeah but you know tell me what it is what is that equal to if I want to expand this that would be log of what Very good, log of x minus log of y. And then the, uh, the top one would be log of x plus log of y. You need to know these two rules. But we start with the second one here. So the top. expression let's assume to be like x and we are at the bottom would be y so it would be x over y like we have here so that would be equal to log of x minus log of y so we can expand it that way let's take a look at this so this would be log of but you have at the top of the fraction with the base 4 and then we put minus log of z to the power of 10 we're going to be using this property here to expand it. If you can follow this up to this point can I see a check mark next to your name? Good. Alright now we can use the other property here log of x times y would be equal to log of x plus log of y so let's see and that would be right here the first one so we have log of square root of x plus log of cube root of 10y and the base is 4 for both of them minus log of 4 log of z to the power of 10 with the base 4 ok we have one more property here where we have log of x to the power of a that is the same as a log of x so this exponent here can go become the coefficient right in here so let's take a look at this, if I can apply any of those. Now the first one is x. Okay, this, what I have x here? Is it supposed to be 3? Well, that's right, that's x. Uh, 
Yeah, that is x to the power of one half. So this is the same as log of x to the power of one half plus log of 10y to the power of one third minus log of z to the power of 10. So now I can move one half right in front of the log of x base 4. I can move one third right in front of log of 10y base 4. Then we can uh, bring 10 right in front of log of z. All of them are base 4. So that's what we have. This is how we expand these. using these uh, three properties. Log of x times y is equal to log of x plus log of y. Log of x over y would equal to log of x minus log of y. Log of x to the power of a is equal to a log of x. So if you can follow this, can I see a check mark next to your name, please? Okay, great.